I'm Hewlett Smith, an occupational therapist and also the co-founder and CEO of Rehab Marked. I'm here today to demonstrate a new product called the Flexor Go. It is a wireless surface EMG. In this session, we're going to show how we can isolate a specific muscle. In this case, we're going to pick uh, the medial um, part of the quadriceps, which is the vastus medialis, and we're going to work on uh, 60 seconds of, uh, of muscle contraction using the Flexor Go app. We're actually going to be just doing the right leg in this session, so I'm going to choose right. I'm going to then click vastus medialis right. It's going to ask me to begin wearing. I want to shape the electrode to begin wearing and connect it. It says connect it. I'm put it right here on the vastus medialis. Medial. I'm aligning it um, longitudinally with the length of the muscle. And now that, that is complete, I'll push down to make sure it's connected well. Megan, if you can extend the knee and contract. We can see right now that she's contracting anywhere between 200 and 500 microvolts. And we're going to do a new record. We're going to do a data only record. And when I click the red button, uh, this, the session will start. So Megan, if you'll go ahead and begin the contraction, I'm now gonna click there for the session to start. So Megan, I would like for you to try to keep the vastus medialis contracted toward the red line. Now let's see what happens if you dorsiflex the foot. Can you also continue to contract? Let's see what type of contraction we can get. Not near as much, we're getting about 200. Let's plantar flex the foot, yep. And with plantar flexion, we're seeing we're actually doubling the microvolts. We've got 20 more seconds. She just took a break, great, all right. <laughs> Take a break and now flex the foot again and really squeeze the vastus medialis. Great, can you see that feedback? I see it. Great for the patient to get the feedback as well. And now we can actually go with the patient and we can actually look at the at the record and see how many microvolts across the 60 seconds. We could obviously establish baseline with this session and then over future sessions we could try to set goals and improve upon that baseline with the end result being a stronger, uh, more stable muscle.